Hi everybody, uh, the session today is all about uh, natural curl in hair. Okay, it's called Urban Natural. Now we're going to talk about first straight away how we've prepped the hair. So I've put into the hair a thermal protection spray and I've also put in there a thermally activated setting aid to hold the curls when we've done it. We've then used the volumizer to give maximum elevations. I'm just going to swap hands so you can see that the narrow part of the blade gets right in there and then with the blow dryer it blow dries the hair from inside to out giving maximum elevation. See? Okay. And the Bortec bristle and nylon bristle give me maximum shine, maximum control and maximum lift. So I've used this throughout the whole head of hair to prep it ready for the second phase which is using the curl bar. So here's the curl bar. The first thing we do is turn the curl bar on here and then we set the temperature. And the temperature ranges between 160 degrees up to 230 degrees. I'm going to set it at 190 degrees. Okay, that's now set at 190 degrees. Now I'm going to set my timer. So just hold this in for a few seconds and it will now change to a timer. There we go. 10 seconds all the way down to one. I'm going to actually set it at 10 seconds. We have an illuminated band here. When I first turned this on, this would be flashing. Once it stops flashing, it means we're now ready to use the product. Okay, I'll tell you more about the product as I prove that I can multitask and we work and talk. Now then normally when I'm doing this particular hairstyle, I would start in the nape of the neck and work throughout the back, then the side and top, and then follow them this side. But I've already done this and prepped it, so what I'm going to do is show you what we've done here. Now we do this quite random, and we make sure that we use different techniques. So I'm going to use twist wrap, I'm going to use flat wrap, I'm going to use volume, I'm going to use drag. Okay, so I'm going to take my first section here and I'm going to take it as a subsection and I'm going to twist wrap and I'm going to use drag. So that means my bar goes on top of there and I twist wrap. Okay, so I'm twisting under tension. When I get to the end, I now press my timer and my thumb is resting on the cool tip. Now, I'm sure you could hear that, but you don't have to hear it. Because actually what happens is, this vibrates to tell me when it's ready to be released. This means that I've got 190 degrees. Now let me just show you here my next one. I'm going to twist wrap again, but this time I'm going to do it with root lift. Okay, so this time the bar goes underneath. Now as I wrap this around the bar, the hair will absorb some of the heat. That means this bar will drop in temperature, not what we want. So the technology in the product is called Pulse Technology and it recognises this is going to happen and the Pulse Technology fires the energy back into the bar to bring it up to temperature again quickly while the 24 karat gold transports that heat across the bar quickly and evenly. So now what we have is 190 degrees on each section from root to tip. We've got 10 seconds on each section. So even heat, even heat distribution, and the same length of time on each section simply means that we've got consistency. So what we've got is an easy method, at the moment twist wrap, alternating. So this again, the bar goes on top. Okay, all the way around to the very, very end, under tension. So it gets a good set. Wait for the timer to tell me when to release. The Pulse technology firing energy back in and the 24 karat gold transporting it. There we go, it's told me. I can now release that gently there to cool and take my next section. So again, about a centimetre in depth on this particular style and 
we're going to alter the way that we wrap again to keep it random. So if we look underneath, we did the bar on top. So yes, that's right. This time we're going to put the bar underneath and we're going to flat wrap. So to flat wrap, hold the hair away from the head. Can you see now how it's flat onto the bar? This will give us again a different type of curl pattern. Click the timer. I'm just going to rock a little bit into the root because I want a little bit of lift. Timer's counting down. There we go. So now we gently release. Now if you look at the two effects, that's one a twist wrap, that's a flat wrap. Completely different effects. And because we're doing urban natural, we want it to be of a natural look. So curls cannot and do not want to be the same. So here we go, nice and flat. Just take it around the bar, keep it flat. Okay, right to the end. And we've put the bar on top. So we're alternating. And I tend to think about it like a, a castle uh, wall at the top. So it's an alternating texture. This is giving me a more natural type of look. So we've got root lift, we've got no root lift. We've got gentle ribbon, we've got twist. So this one, of course, goes on top. Okay. Nice and flat. My finger to touch in, touch in of the cool tip which stays pretty cold. It's certainly not warm enough to be worrying about at all, whatsoever. Okay, and now I'm gonna take out this final section here. Or I think it's my final section. No, perhaps not. Perhaps it's a little bit deep. Look, so I'm just gonna take that at an angle and just take that across there. I'm gonna place that there and take this subsection here. Again, that was root lift and it was flat wrap. So this time I'm going to put the bar on top and I'm going to twist wrap. Okay, I think you've got the idea now. This gives me a random feel to it. I've done this throughout the whole head. So, there we are. It's ready now to release, nice and gentle. Take this one again, we're going in with a twist wrap. Let's take that onto one side. This one was drag, so this one is root lift. Just had a quick look there just to check that I was actually right. And I was, this is with me multitasking. <laughs> I can do it, I promise. Okay, so the next one, the bar goes on top and we twist around. I'm just going to smooth that out, it just felt a little bit rough under my hand. So again, twist. You can see all the different types of patterns there. None of them are blending together. Now if you've watched our symmetrical wave video, we wanted the exact opposite effect where we wanted everything to flow together and blend. Here, we want them all to fight each other. We don't want the blend. So again, here, we're on a flat wrap with root lift. Right to the end, last section. Now what I've got here is the hair inside the hair net. Now normally I would leave a section like this at least 10 minutes to cool down so that we get a really good set. I'm not going to do that because I just don't have the luxury of that time. However, what I have done, and this is just a, a, a tip for in salon, quite often in salon, you do not have time to pin every single section back. Ideally we would, but we just don't. So what we can do is put the hair into the hair net. That way it can cool in situ. Let's say we're not going to have that possibility today. So what I'm just going to do, we've got that, I'm just going to turn this off, pop it over here, and I'm just going to 
hold this in my hand for a few seconds just to help cool the hair down. So my hands are just going to absorb some of that heat and just let it cool down a little bit of my hand. Shake it out. Now, to help me dress this out, I'm just going to apply a small amount of serum to my hands. And I do mean a very, very small amount of serum. Very small amount. When I apply this, I make sure that it's all over my hands so that it doesn't go into just one area of the head. And to start with, I'm just going to just pull my fingers through this a little bit. And just shake it about a bit because I'm going to do something a little bit unconventional in a second. So I'm going to take this off the stand because what I would do in the salon is turn the client's head upside down, apply some dry hairspray or in this case I'm going to put a little bit of powder in and I use both my hands to dress it out and shake it out so I'm just going to turn my client's head upside down now I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit of powder into the hair and what will happen is because of the technique that we've used each of these curls will fight each other and create a really natural looking head of hair. Throw it back into place, back, Okay guys, this is it, fully dressed out, urban, natural curls, fighting each other, hope you like it, see you soon, bye.